Good morning, everybody. It is Friday, June 14th, I believe, 2019. You know, I just have to say, it's a beautiful world we live in. But I also am questioning this morning why it takes me two hours to get outside every day from the time I get out of bed. I can get up at 4.30 and not make it outside until 6.30. Which kind of defeats the whole purpose of getting up at 4.30 in my opinion, but whatever. Alright, so... I brought all these guys out here last night. Moved the lemon tree out into the garden to start getting it used to direct sunlight. Um, and our yellow onion is gonna go on the ground today. Uh, I think I'm just gonna name them onion. Cause I just think that's so funny. And then I brought the blackberries out here last night as well. Um, everything's doing good. I haven't checked the squash in a couple days. Let's see what's going on. We've got a couple babies on there. And a couple babies over here. And those squash were so delicious. Or that zucchini. That. I only had one, sorry. Not they. It was very delicious. We put it in a stir fry. Um, and it was good. So we got our first baby acorn squash trying to come up. I'm going to keep watch on all these uh, squashes too. So I think I might need to start pollinating them by hand. We don't have very many pollinators around here. Um, and I can't just say like this year because you all know this is our first year doing this. I don't know. If this is just the norm in this area, or a couple babies on there, but I still need to trim this beast out. This guy's a beast. Um, yeah, I just don't know. I don't know if it's the area, or if it's, we don't have enough flowers. Oh, look at that dude go. Woo! Sorry. Okra. Okra, okra, okra. And there's another one trying right there. Okay. Yeah. So these kurabi, the kurabi and the, um, the one head of cauliflower we have living have gotten attacked terribly by something. And I did purchase the sprays I was telling y'all about, neem oil, and, oh crap, um, yeah, I'm gonna say it wrong, so I'm not gonna say it, and I know I told you the other day, I'll let you know when I read it, but, uh, yeah, um, anyways, I sprayed them. April sprayed them in the morning, and I just came out and sprayed them last night. That's a big old spider web I'm about to walk into. Can you see it? Probably not. Alright, let's check the cantaloupe. Freshly planted cantaloupe. Look like they're doing pretty good. Bionic woman is gorgeous. So everything's looking good. I'm happy with that. Um, we're gonna work on getting that pile of uh, sticks and stems and stuff over on the other side of the fence line out of the garden so that we can get this uh, area back here weeded and prepped for our Malabar spinach. We want it to actually grow up the fence and hopefully take over 
so we'll see. Like I said, I think we got about half of this done. It just looks like a huge pterodactyl nest or something. It's awesome. All right. Okay, y'all. That's it. I'm going to quit blabbering and get on with the day. Um, and I'm going to mention it now so that I remember it later when I'm editing, so it might not be until t tomorrow's video, but... I want to talk to you guys about trees. Yeah, because I learned a lot yesterday. Um, hanging out with Richard and Linda. And getting, getting and gaining their knowledge of uh, the apricot tree. And helping them in their little garden. It was fun. I helped them... Uh, trim up their plants and call and talk to them about different things and what was going on with their squashes and tomatoes and just sharing knowledge, you know? But, all right. Tell you what, I'll talk to you tomorrow about that because I know I'm not gonna remember it later in the day. So, stay safe wherever you are in the world. And until next time, much love y'all all right y'all i'm sorry i forgot but <clears throat> i do that all the time to you guys so this is interesting and i will say to you that just a few days after i um planted these mango seeds david the good did a video and that's where i learned about the whole poly versus mono um, trees from seed at least on the mango <clears throat> but I'm going to need to contact him because if you look this came up yesterday which means I have three and I don't know what's up with that and another bit of good news I noticed this last night that itty bitty little sprout is the beginning of a papaya tree so this whole tray of trees that we're gonna get are from dumpster diving that's right other than the dirt and the perlite there's no cost to us at all. So, no seed cost. Making do with what you got, y'all. Alright. Enough for now. Enough for now. Yeah, that's how you say that. I'll talk to you guys soon. Much love.
I don't know if I got him or not. I'm scaring him. If I cut him on video. There he is. Where? He's coming back my way. About midway. See right here. Oh. See him hop? Looks like a little baby dinosaur. He's coming right towards me. Going out the back. Do you see him? Yeah. I see him. I just can't tell if I got him on the viewfinder because the glare of the sun. There he is. No! 